Alexander the Great, also known as Alexander III of Macedon, was a renowned ancient Greek king and military commander. He was born in 356 BCE in Pella, the ancient capital of Macedonia. Alexander's father was King Philip II of Macedon, and his mother was Queen Olympias. He received a rigorous education under the tutelage of the philosopher Aristotle. At the age of 20, after his father's assassination, Alexander ascended to the throne in 336 BCE. One of Alexander's most important achievements was his military conquests. He set out to fulfill his father's dream of expanding Macedon's empire, and he went on to create one of the largest empires of the ancient world. His conquests began with the defeat of the Persian Empire, which had ruled over much of the known world. In 334 BC, Alexander crossed the Hellespont into Asia Minor and won a series of battles against the Persians, including the Battle of Issus. He then continued his eastward campaign, capturing cities and territories along the way. His most famous conquest was the city of Babylon. In the year 327 BCE, with determination etched into his eyes, Alexander led his battle-hardened troops across the formidable Hindu Kush mountains, venturing into the mystic land of India. The tales of its riches and wonders had reached his ears, igniting a fervor within his heart. As Alexander's forces descended into the northern realms of the Indian subcontinent, they clashed with the valiant King Porus of the Parava kingdom. The fabled battle of the Hydaspes River ensued, where both sides fought with unmatched courage. In the end, the Macedonian phalanx proved its might, and Porus stood defeated. Yet, Alexander, recognizing Porus's valor, spared his life and allowed him to rule under his benevolent gaze. With each step deeper into India, Alexander's army faced challenges beyond their imagination. The unrelenting terrain, unforgiving climate, and relentless battles left his soldiers weary and heartsick. They had been far from their homes for years, and whispers of longing for the familiar began to spread through the ranks. The vastness of India stretched before them like an endless tapestry, each thread representing an uncharted realm with its own mysteries and dangers. News of powerful empires lying further to the east, like the Nanda Empire, sent tremors of trepidation through the troops. The prospect of unending conflict in an alien land weighed heavily upon their souls. In 325 BCE, with the setting sun casting long shadows across the land, Alexander faced a pivotal decision. His heart pulled in two directions, onward to uncharted glory or back to his beloved Macedonia. The murmurs of his exhausted soldiers grew into a crescendo of desire for home. The great conqueror, their leader, saw the fatigue in their eyes and heard the longing in their voices. And so, with a heavy heart and the legacy of dreams unfulfilled, Alexander made his fateful choice. The mighty conqueror turned his gaze westward, setting the course for Babylon, the heart of his empire. He left behind garrisons in his wake, determined to maintain a semblance of control over the lands he had touched. The journey homeward was not without its trials. The vast Indian subcontinent, which had once beckoned with promises of greatness, now lay behind him. As Alexander and his men traversed the treacherous terrains and faced skirmishes with local tribes, the shadow of fatigue and longing loomed ever larger. Alexander's empire eventually extended as far east as India. However, his soldiers, tired from years of continuous warfare, urged him to turn back. In 325 BCE, he began his return journey to Babylon but died suddenly in 323 BCE, possibly due to a fever or infection. He was only 32 years old. Alexander's death led to a power struggle among his generals, known as the Diadochi, who divided his empire into several kingdoms. His legacy extended beyond his military conquests. 
he played a crucial role in spreading Greek culture, language, and ideas throughout the lands he conquered. This period is known as the Hellenistic Era. Alexander's life and accomplishments continue to inspire fascination and study to this day. His leadership, military prowess, and contributions to history have left an indelible mark on the world. Thanks for watching my channel. Please like, subscribe, and comment.